GoPro hasn't overheated already, but we are in a newer spot just across from the lake because my bike's over there somewhere. If my if the GoPro can even see it. Tiny, tiny, tiny lure. But I have a question for the fish. Will they go for a big lure? Is the question. Like, will they go for, like, a saltwater lure? That's the real question. Oh my god, that means I can tie on my mullet lure. Dude, that would be sick. Imagine catching a fish the same size as your lure. Oh my god. That now gives me an idea. Blue, blue, blue greatest idea of all time <laughs> wow most of this pond is in the light who could it be now Got it. Aw, oh, dude, I see, I saw it come up. Got him, got him. Oh yeah. No. Came off. Okay, yeah, I can't taunt him with the, uh, the tip of the whoa that was close Oh my god, little, um, little bass are going after it, Jesus. Like, bass, like, maybe twice the size of this thing are going after it. Which is pretty cool. What happens if I cast it straight outwards? Wow, that went far. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, there was a splash in the middle. If I do a semi-fast retrieval, oh my god, I just skipped it. I really need to practice my skipping of lures. Because, like, dude, that was sick.
Out in the middle, yes, sir. Oh my god, I also have a pinfish lure. I also have spinner baits and stuff, but like, I never use those because I just don't like spinner baits. Kind of suck. Yes, I get to get people mad because, oh yeah, spinner baits suck, and everyone, a lot of people think they actually don't. In my experience with them, they never caught me fish, so. easily be I'm using them wrong I'm using the right the wrong time I don't really care I'm not gonna use them I'll use them on occasion but like that's almost never it's also mostly salt water that I use them even though I have fresh water on it I think they'll go after this probably Tie it on and see. Because I have a. Uh... Damn, what's it called? Um... Not a spinning setup. Straight enough. Who could be now? 